Excuse the background, so mess I know. But today's video, I'm gonna be doing a back market review. So about a week ago, yeah, about a week ago, I ordered a MacBook from Back Market. It really probably could have came faster, but I ordered it right before the New Year, so it took a little bit longer, I guess. But it shipped in this box here. Honestly, the packaging ain't so sturdy. It's already I haven't even tried to open it. It's open. But it's not, you can't really hear it moving around, so I guess that's good. Okay. Obviously, you don't need no scissors to open it, so. This is what the inside of the box looks like. It's got bubble wrap. Okay. So, it does come with a charger, brand new. So, brand new Apple charger. I just got so much exposure. But it's a brand new charger. So the MacBook comes actually wrapped inside of this little sleeve. That's literally all that's in here. <laughs> all that's in the box is bubble wrap, the MacBook, and the charger. So this is everything that they send you. They don't send you no nothing but also back market oh, this is also not sponsored as you know um there it's not shipped from back market it's almost like ebay or amazon okay so it's honestly this one is in good condition oh yeah and i also paid a hundred and thirty dollars for this i got a real good deal because now when i go back and look they're like two thirty three hundred dollars for one that's in good condition Honestly, there is not one visible scratch on the outside. Oh yeah, I also got the MacBook Air 11 inch one. So pretty small. It's almost like, I don't know, not bad. Okay, all the ports look pretty good. And this is also the 2015 one, so it is updatable. I have never had a MacBook, so I'm not sure. So, yeah, it's booting up. So, it did come with a little charge on it. And also, the screen, really, really good. No scratches on the screen. No scratches or anything. Like, it looks brand new, honestly. They sent me the MacBook box, I would have and I would have thought it was brand new. So I do actually see one tiny, tiny scratch that you probably can't even see on camera. So yeah, let's click the United States. Screen also looks good. Click the United States and continue. Mac OS contains a built-in screen reader called VoiceOver. If you know how to use VoiceOver, press Command F5 now to turn it on and set up your Mac. If you would like to learn how to use voiceover to set up your Mac, press the escape key. I don't know, I just want to go. Okay. I do, let's see, what, I don't. Okay, so I got the Wi-Fi set up. I didn't do the one that was on my phone because that one was way too long. So I just went and looked at the Wi-Fi box and used that password. Uh, do you want to transfer your information from Mac and those? No, I don't. I just want this to kind of be like brand new almost. But I am going to hook up one of my Apple IDs. Mm -mm, trying to debate which Apple ID I'm going to use. Because somehow on my phone I got three Apple IDs hooked up. Like one for Apple Music, like one for my regular like pictures and stuff. I don't know how it got separated. But, yeah. It's, yeah. 
I got another laptop that I have Sims on. Sims is eating up all the space over there. So I had to get a new laptop and I really wanted a MacBook. So I felt like, let me check out Back Market. This um, MacBook is updatable. I think the 2015 is the last one that is updatable. So I wanted to at least get one that was updatable. And I got this one for a literal steal on this website. All right, so I ended up having to watch a video. So basically, it's just a problem Apple's having for the last couple of weeks. So I had to basically go back and skip the sign up now. So I'll have to sign up once I actually get into. So next, I don't know why I'm taking y'all through how to set up a MacBook. Once I get it set up, then I'll come back, y'all, because I guess y'all know how to set a MacBook up. You know how to set an iPhone up. So yeah. Okay, so I have the macbook all set up and it's actually a macbook because i was reading some reviews on some other refurbisher websites and they were like they send you something that looks just like a macbook whenever you start uh doing the setting up and actually get on the computer it's actually an android so they kind of like they scam you but this one is actually a macbook i've got my phone is actually cooked up to it i don't know how long that's gonna last like my messages pop up and you know FaceTime all that stuff. I don't know if I want all that hooked up to it. I probably should have made a separate Apple ID for this, but I don't really care. So yeah, that is the video. I'm currently trying to download iMovie because I love iMovie. That's what I use to edit sometimes. So yeah, this video will actually be edited on this. So if the edit looks all right, then the MacBook is doing okay. But yeah, this is honestly in great condition. They said it was in good, but it's in great. Like, there's a tiny little chip. Like, if you were being very, like, looking real close, you might could see some imperfections. But honestly, this is what the bottom looks like. All the ports. I haven't even seen. Let me see if the charger works because I didn't even try to, you know, use the charger yet. And it's honestly... I think this is an actual Apple charger because sometimes they'll send you just a, a generic charger. Dang on, they got this joint tied up good enough. Once I get this open, I'm going to come back. Okay, so I got it all plugged up. <laughs> Do it not work? I'm not tweaking. Okay. Okay, so as of right now, it's not working. Let me see if I gotta change my charging thingy or what. But as of now, it's not working. So y'all can see. going like, is there something I need to okay it's charging now I don't know I did literally did nothing but take that little piece out but as you can see the thing is glowing it's like half charged so I guess I'll keep it on the charger but yeah works great so i would honestly i would recommend it uh they actually they don't they have more stuff they have newer macbooks i think they have like 2016 and 17 for like three or four hundred like they got phones they got everything up there so i honestly i would recommend it uh customer service is I guess good the reviews are good on their customer service I didn't have to use customer service which is good um, but yeah they also have a student discount which I use so if you're a student in college use that student discount it's not much but it's it's I think it's only like five percent but it's five percent is good enough and they also I think they got military discount so got military discount you can use that as well but yeah, thank you all for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Turn on post notifications and my social media. It will be linked in the description box down below.